today uh, for another Hump Day Unboxing. <laughs> oh, yeah, guys. I did that. I did you did that. that. You did that. You know what? They have been commenting saying, Terry, don't leave Mike alone. There goes Terry again. She's leaving Mike alone. Whoa! <laughs> is that really happening? <laughs> You're oh like gosh, a kid I'm... in a candy store when I leave you. I feel like I need to start watching these comments, guys. <laughs> Hey, welcome back to our channel, guys. I am glad that you're here today. Yes, Terry is my superstar. Man. And I just felt like I needed wow. to say that to the today. world? So, for the world, you guys. For the world? Yes, for the wow, world. Wow, that, so. that was sweet. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> you're welcome. So, here we are. Another Costco palette, guys. But what day is it, Mike? I did say hump day unboxing, but I didn't do it right. I need to say hump day. It's official. Now we can yeah. do this. <laughs> <laughs> bark, 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 Welcome bark, 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 back, bark. everybody. <laughs> Guess what day it is. <laughs> hey, you know what? While you're cutting this open, I'm going to give them a quick rundown, okay? We are doing this one for a reason, though, guys, because we had we a are. customer yesterday message, and they bought. You ready for this? They bought every single Timber Ridge lawn chair and Timber Ridge lounge chair that we have already, uh, the anti-gravity lounge, that we have already Correct. unboxed. And they said, we need three more. So, give us more. We kind of peeked in here a little bit. I could see the top of the packaging and it looks like we might have more. So here we go. We're going to we go. open this one up and see what we got. Cut her open. Here we go. Well, Mike's got that open. If you're new to our channel, welcome. If you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button for us, you guys. And I hope you all have your beverage ready. Let's have a great Wednesday hump day here. And all in. This is palette number, uh -oh, what palette number are we? Six? Six, I think. Yeah, count the rest. This is palette number six of the 11 Costco run. So all in $360 for this palette. And what did you do? You guys oh, saw my cat-like reflexes. Knife. They oh, saw it. I went like this one. Oh. Jumped real fast. All right, guys. We're all good. Nobody got hurt. And I wanted to give a shout out because one of our amazing subscribers, and he is in the coffee crew. Hello, Haskell. Haskell! Yo, rascal! Yo, rascal, Haskell! <laughs> I hope you're having a good day. Okay, Mike, let's do this. Are we ready? Uh oh. <gasps> My. Go ahead. I don't know what to do. I'm confused. <laughs> Mike's gonna run next door <laughs> to this door. I'm gonna go ahead and start this, you guys. Let's see what we got in here. So I can tell, obviously, from the wheels. Oh boy. This chair. Woo! You're back. False alarm, guys. Oh, oh, really? So we have a little beeper that has a motion sensor, and sometimes if it's sunny and it catches a little shadow or or a reflection or something, it'll trigger it. Holy smoke! This is a nice this? chair. I know, look at the gap. What's what's that all about? Lumbar support. Oh. We test it. Are you? You're braver than I was. I wasn't wow. about to sit in that. Wow. Here, let me push you. Ready? Yeah. Get ready. Good. Ah! Well, I went over the boat. I need a string. We could just like yank it. We could tie it to the back of a vehicle. Do not try this at home. <laughs> okay, so how right. much for this? This is a nice chair, you guys. It's super comfortable. It does have a little something here. I have no idea. Um, it's used. I can see it on the wheels and stuff. Yeah. I'm just gonna randomly say fifty bucks. Okay. Um, I have no idea the I'm brand looking for or a return sticker, but without us pulling up the manifest, we wouldn't know. I'm just gonna say fifty dollars. It's just a random guess. So okay. It's a nice chair, though. It is missing forty dollars. Yeah, it's missing some, a little cover right there. Thirty-five dollars. Now I got grease on. Thirty. It keeps going down. Oh 30, man! I got thirty-five dollars. Quit pulling out the bad stuff on it to me. What is that? 
I don't know. Oh, I feel yeah, like the disgusting sins are in here, guys. Interesting. All right. Whatever that is. I feel like I need to move this drink off. Okay, so cross your fingers. We have not had good luck with these. We've gotten these many times, and they're usually always damaged. So this is a pop-up. What do they call it? Like a papasan chair? Yeah. They call it a disc chair, I think. So far, it looks fine. Holy cow! Is this one good? And the sorry. still got tags attached to the back. There's some scuff. Wow. Thirty dollars. Wow. Thirty dollars in our pocket. All said and done. Unless it goes in. These are not. These are comfortable, guys. Right? Never mind. I was gonna say maybe <laughs> this would be our new break room chair. Thirty bucks. There we go. There is one. You got it. No, you go ahead. Timber Ridge. One Timber Ridge. This isn't the kind she wanted, though. I hope we got. The, hope we selected the right what, palette. What's the what's what's the what's different that she she would want? She wants the uh, like the lawn chair style, not the. Uh, wait, what is going on with this? This one's no good, guys. Why? This one's smashed. Can you see it all crooked I on see here? It. And it smashed so bad the frame's completely broken too. Oh, so that's this such one's a sad thing. This one's a goner. Yeah, this one's no that good. That is so sad. You know who would love some time to go to the dump with you? We <laughs> Ooh, Haskell the Rascal? Marie. Marie. Uh, she would have so much fun throwing everything with you. I'll tell you guys something. <laughs> so when we go to the dump. Terry does it too. We both do it. It's such a gratifying feeling. You'll go to the dump and it's a big pit, you know, a big, big pit and you're unloading your truck, you're throwing stuff off, but you always see stuff down in there like old windows, um, an, old, an old mirror. Sometimes you'll see a glass bottle. Maybe we got a glass bottle we're throwing, whatever it may be. It's just sometimes so gratifying to take like this heavy chair and throw it down there and break that window. I mean, it's gonna get. They're gonna be like, "What is wrong with you?" It just feels good. It you know, the window is gonna good. get broke anyway, guys. So you. The bulldozer tractor is yeah. gonna come through there and destroy it anyhow. So, so it's great therapy. <laughs> that one's no good, guys. We've been selling those for sixty-five bucks a piece. So that 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 is a painful loss right there. Whoa! Why didn't you let me do that? Well, I you know honestly got it. I don't know. So let me write that wagon. chair down for a zero. We've got a beach wagon, guys. Okay. Tags are still on. I see that much. But the wheels are dirty. Barely. This thing looks like... <laughs> looks like they used it one time. I mean, this thing's immaculate. Barely some dust on those wheels. I sold one of these yesterday for $75. Brand new, though. So we're going to call this one... Uh, 60? 65 bucks, I think 65. we can. I mean, don't you think? These would be amazing at the flea market. It's missing. Imagine how much we could put oh, wait. in it. Oh, no, the XL, those big long ones. Oh. So it's missing the uh, the little netting. Okay. So where's the netting? You're off on a run. And he's running back, folks. Okay. You remember that wagon that came in the other day? Gotcha. That was had the broken handle. It was no okay. good. I saved the netting out of it. Gotcha. So now we've got a complete unit here. 60, 65? 65, you said. All right. That's what that was. I didn't know what that, Boom. Was, what that was. Yes! That's a good hit. This thing's just ugly. I don't know what's going on here, guys. Oh, this is gross. I'm like... It's gross. I'm that's feeling really, a... That's really gross, you guys. A sizable amount of disappointment right now. This is really gross. Why? 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 I don't know. I don't like stuff near So, are any of you that are not familiar <laughs> with Costco, <laughs> Costco's return policy is we will take anything back anytime ever in the history of all time. So if you bought it from Costco 20 years ago, and all of a sudden you just don't like it anymore, you can take it back. Well, guess what just happened? Look at this thing, you guys. It is gross. And the worst thing of it is, is most of the time, when stuff like this comes back, it'll say the reason they return it is because it was defective. Really? 
Look how dirty it is on the bottom. That is just... That if is, this says they return it because it's defective, I'm going to lose it. This is not defective. This is it you defective used it. It's defective because they abused it. You used it until it completely broke. It's so defective, I can't even get it. I want to see it. I mean, if it's good, it, it could still be good, you know? No, they bent it. It could just be completely just broken. Get this junk out of here. I'm going to use this for a decade. Bust it on a drunk campfire party night, and then take it back and say it was defective and it made me fall. It's a San Francisco 49ers chair, guys. I don't know if that means that anything. Me I don't know. If you're a 49ers fan, I apologize. I didn't mean anything by that. Um, I don't know. I cracked myself. Up. I don't know. <laughs> Use it for a decade. Here, let's do something different. Please. That is something that looks kind of neat. <laughs> I feel like this is some sort of a chair. It's really cool. Oh, my. What? What the heck? Put that up on this table and show them that. That. Okay, this is fun. This is some sort of a chair here, guys. I don't know why it's got all this tape, though. I feel like it's broke. Oh, gosh. It looks like it has wooden dowels that go all the way through, and it. maybe it's broke. Well, let's cut the tape to find out. We need to find out, right? We need to find out. They all yeah. want to know. We want to know. Oh, let me show you what it looks like. Inquiring minds front. want to know. Here we go. Tell you what, I don't know if I feel safe if this thing is even stable enough to sit in. I guess I'll have to try it just to show everybody. But um, it looks to be okay. Well, why not? You're still under 50. Go for it. This is weird. <laughs> I don't know if I. <laughs> I'm totally scared to do this. <laughs> All right, bear with me. Here we go. Wait, wait, wait! Watch! Are you kidding me right now? I said that you were my superstar. Oh my gosh! Oh. How is it? This is weird. Is it? It's surprisingly comfortable. I guess. Try it. No. <laughs> no. All right. I have no clue. There is nothing on this for return. I mean, I, 30 bucks? Or? I have no idea. It's solid wood. $30. Uh, we're we're going to start with 30 Hey, guys. Mike is going to the candy store all by himself. Keep, it, keep an eye on him. Oh, okay. All right, guys. Here we go. Ah, this big box right here, I believe, had two of those chairs in it that I need. Oh, oh man. And I think they're brand new, guys. Timber Ridge. Bowling lawn chair. Brand new, factory packed. And another one, brand new factory pack. Guys, this was a case pack right here. It was torn open on the side. All right. These are 40 bucks a piece. The lady that bought all the chairs yesterday, she already said she wanted at least three more of these. So these two are sold already. 40 and 40. Nothing better than having your product sold before you even get it off the pallet. All right. Okay, I see some more good stuff in here. Hopefully the hopefully the condition comes out good. Here we go. So we got another one of these disc chairs. It's got all the tags still attached to the back. This one appears, that could just be warehouse dust. It's hard to tell. It is a little dusty. There it is right there. How much did we write this down for? I think 30. I'm going to write it down for 30. 
I'm actually surprised we got a pallet of these last year. I think we had about eight or ten of those, and every single one of them was the frame was either bent or the fabric was ripped out. So I'm actually pretty surprised right now that we got two good ones in a row. Okay. You know what, let's see if we can do it again, guys. We got another one. Same thing. Another disc chair. Hey, this one has a return thing. Let's find out what they say the value is on it. it says the value is $40. They return it because they didn't want it. Well, obviously, because if they wanted it, they wouldn't have returned it, right? Um, this one, it's got a little goober right there. I don't know what that is. It's the cacus. Um, <laughs> It looks like it's food or something. We could probably just get a damp cloth. They'll probably wipe right off. I'm still going to call it $30. All right. Wow. Three of those. Three in a row. And they're all good. Okay. You guys, we are down to two items left. And uh, this one doesn't look very good. So we've got another beach wagon. Clearly has a broken handle. This, oh man, this thing is all messed up, guys. Um, tires are very worn. We're not even gonna be able to sell this one. Well, this one's just gonna be zero. Um, I may try to give it away for free. Somebody might just wanna use it for they, you know, there's a, there's a lot of guys out there that will try to, you know, repair stuff. They'll, they'll take a, an old handle off a shovel or something and rebuild that, and they'll use it in their, in their shop or in their garden or whatever. But it's not, this is not haul your kid around friendly or quality. So we're going to call it zero. Oh, last item. This it all comes down to this one, guys. Remember, we're in this pallet for 360 bucks. I just don't feel like we're, we've got it yet. Another beach car, beach wagon. Whew, that was heavy. This one's still in the box. They returned it because it says did not need. Well, thank you because I do need it. Right. I sure hope she's making a lot of money over there. Somebody's got to pay my wages. All right. Ooh. Um, this one's brand new, guys. This one's still factory packed in there. Boom! $75! Yes! Oh, man. We needed that one. All right. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to write down that 75 bucks. I'm going to take a quick break. I'm going to add these numbers all up. I'm going to go find her, and then we'll come back with your total. So be right back. All right, guys, we're back. Got it all. I got it all added up. Yeah, it's me this time. It is. So. Magical numbers. I can't lie. I told her already. <laughs> I'm a terrible liar. All right, guys, so I added it all up. Obviously, we had three zeros on this one, so uh, that hurt. But... Um, as we established in the beginning, we paid $360 for each one of these Costco pallets. And this one, we are going to get $375 out of it. So only a projected profit of 15 bucks. But that's okay because we didn't lose. Did not lose. And you know, we got to take a bad pallet with all the good, right? You do. Right? And there's some of them here, guys, that are going to still have probably major money in them. So I think it's still going to oh, balance think, out really good in the end. What just happened? You think we would have been getting all it? You broke the pen into the major money ones. <laughs> so you guys, of course, have a great hump day, and we will see you for fun Friday. Food Friday. Okay. All right. Take care, everybody. Bye, guys. Bye. Bye.